Hello everyone, this is Mizan from Doric. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can add drop down menu in our navigation element. We have recently added the feature drop down. So, right now I am on our website builder. Uh, I have added our section, row, and column, and I'm going to add our navigation element. And if you add navigation element uh, in a new website, it will load with a default drop down automatically so you can get an idea how it works but if you are if you want to add a drop down to your existing navigation just come to drop downs and add a navigate like turn on the drop down for any navigation link let's say we have home uh, drop down and link 3 i want to add drop down menu in link 3 so I'll just come here and turn it on, add new uh, link and drop down um, link three. So here you can see drop down is here. We can uh, link the drop down to external link or page or section. Let's say I want to link it to a page. You can select home or page two. I have only two pages, home page and page two, or we can uh go to the like home page and also we can add section like we can uh, link this uh, drop down to a section or like email to or call to a uh, call to link so uh, we have this option also added recently and then we have usual uh link features like icon and open in new tab and uh, and data attributes so now i'll show how how we can style the drop down let's say we have this style ready we can add border radius let's say we, we want to make the box rounded more rounded so right now we have five pixel we can keep it just uh, just for now we can also change the background color let's say i'll, I'll make it uh, something like a little bit green or maybe bluish okay so you can see the background is changed we can add the padding i'll show how it works like i'll just increase the value so we can see and you can see the spacing increased around the box it will be more visible once we go to the styling the links so let's go and we have the uh, shadows like we can add top shadow or inner shadow we have already a shadow i can change the color so we can see and uh, see the shadow i'll just move it something like uh, red you can see the red shadow behind also we can resize the text we can increase the text uh, like link link text size let's say 33 30 pixel you can see it's bigger right now i can make it smaller again also i can we can change the color right now it's dark we can make it uh, uh, blue or something like that you can see it's blue right now also we have usual settings like line height and spacing also we can have separate background for the link items let's say we have the background blue here and we want uh, something like white background inside uh, just behind these links let's uh, give it a white background and you can see back, uh, like links have a, a white background right now also we can add paddings and uh, padding top left uh, bottom right on the uh, on the links too also we have underline and over and through strike through styles and if we add any icons like uh, let's add some icon in into the uh, drop down let's say i want this icon and here i'm gonna add this icon and i'm gonna add one more icon okay so we're fine we have three icons and we can like increase the gap between the text and icon and we can move them to the right or left so that's the basic styling uh, for uh, uh, top down menu and how you can add and if you face any issues please feel free to reach out and thank you so much